everybody. So they're, they're going to start us whenever we sit, basically. So this is the intro. So, yeah, we're going to have 30 minutes. We'll eat these massive, delicious-looking burgers and these massive milkshakes. So, yeah, we're about to get started. They're really, really hot, but it should be good. Okay. Hey everyone, welcome to today's video where today we are at Stacked in Oakland, Pennsylvania, which is essentially a suburb of Pittsburgh or a part of Pittsburgh. This is where I guess like the university is. So this kind of area is dab smack known for the university area and this kind of stacked Oakland or the stacked location essentially directly served to the university population. Um, the university was literally right up the road. It was visible from this spot and this was like right before i guess a football game got out or the football game started or one or the other so it was like the place was already full and the crowds like the streets were starting to like flood with people so we had to like get in get our seat and order right away to get our challenges so thank you for accommodating us do appreciate that hence why we're all like squished into this little seat right here with not much room so the way they start this challenge, you have 30 minutes to complete this 12 patty burger with the milkshake and the fries, totaling I would say about maybe 5 pounds. Um, the thing with this though is the 30 minute time limit starts as soon as it hits the table. So it was like literally they hit the table, I basically was able to turn on my camera and the girl started the time on us there. These actually remind me of McDonald's fries. So not surprisingly, the burgers were super duper hot, um, to which you actually see me using ketchup. Like, I mean, I enjoy ketchup, so I was using it partly to, you know, just to eat, but I was actually using it as like a method of cooling off the food. So, you know, I guess ketchup can be functional in this situation. Um, the milkshakes, you had a couple different flavors. I went with Butterfinger, Darren went with uh, chocolate peanut butter, Darian went with Oreo, and honestly, these were the best, The well, well, yeah, I'll give it away. These were the best tasting milkshakes I've ever had in my life, so you gotta check it out. If you're claustrophobic, this challenge may not be for you. I've never had less room in a challenge in my life. But I can't even like open my shoulders up. So it was really interesting. Burgers kind of resembled McDonald's patties in a way. Um, they didn't quite taste like McDonald's, but the fries tasted identical to McDonald's. I swear these were McDonald's fries. We literally were like, is there a McDonald's next door and the kitchens are attached? Uh, but then those milkshakes, oh boy. You gotta wait to see what those milkshakes are like. We also have some more fun shenanigans and maybe a surprise extra addition to this challenge at the end. So with that everybody, I'll let you enjoy the rest of it and let's see what happens. Seven-ish minutes, eight minutes. Fries actually taste 
milk cake or milk dog cake from the knife. Cheers. Cheers, brother. Is it good? It's real, really good. It's really cool. So this is a Butterfinger milkshake. Whoa! It, it doesn't count. It tastes like Butterfingers. It's definitely made with cream, you can taste it.
Enjoyed. Thanks for watching. I have nothing else to say until next time. So you have to be hungry. You have to eat it.